Hello and welcome, this is Mouse Gunner, and we're back with some more Starbound with Leo, and we're doing this quest over again because this game's a bastard. But we're not far from getting this done. Uh, thankfully, the second time through is a little bit easier because we know what to expect. Nice. Right, I'll go on my side. We can go ahead and flip these switches right now, I guess. Okay, I'll be the one. Oh, yeah, good job. Did it again. Yeah, no need to slow down as much. Oh, uh, I got hit. Oh, I'm going to get hit again. Okay. I'm back up. Uh, okay. Again. Um, shoot. I can't quite reach it now. I can, I can. Alright. Took a lot of damage in doing that, but I'm not gonna bother healing myself, which may be a risk. The first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna uh, run over here and do that. Yay, I did it! You can have what's in that chest because I, I took the other chest. I think that's fair. Yeah, see, that didn't... Done when that didn't happen. So can you activate this? I guess I could have. Problem was this guy was standing in front of it, so I thought I couldn't activate it. I don't know. I don't know, but in any case, it's already activated for me, so let's just go back. Oh. All right. So, sorry, everybody, you guys had to see that again, but All right. it's the nature, I guess, of what happened. Maybe we will learn from that mistake. Well, uh, did you add the uh, two-stop teleshop uh, to your um, bookmarks for transporters? How do I do that? Uh, you just try to use it. I'll ask if you want to add it to your bookmarks. Oh, sure. Yeah, okay, cool. That way we don't have to jump through hoops to get back here again. Oh, and you can buy teleporters. And... All right, now let me go complete the quest. Okay. Ah, oh, this is the animation you were talking about? Mm-hmm. Okay. So now you need to go talk to Esther, I think. Taking this slow because I don't want to die at the stake. This. Mech part crafting. Okay. Blank for me. Okay, I don't think I have any of these parts. I did. Going the wrong way? Yes. Well, it depends on what you want to do. Uh, I thought we were going to go to talk to that lady. Well, right. then we need to go this way. All right. <laughs> I'm just scanning everything. I do wonder what this is. Oh, it's another teleporter. Looks like a teleporter of some kind. Press it once and it turns flashlight. Okay. Or you get jutting off. Ought to be running. So now you can just scan everything and get a cute little colorful mark on some things. So is it this stuff we're supposed to be scanning or something somewhere else? Uh, pretty much anything you can find, basically. As long as you've got the scanner mode on, anything you have not scanned before is uh, glowing blue. 
and anything you have scanned is glowing uh, orange of the things you can scan. Okay. I'm not sure if it's going to be useful, but I, I suppose so. In any case, what do we do next? I suppose we could go back to the ship. Or just scan everything we can find over here first. Wasn't that what we're supposed to be doing? Well, rest? to a degree. I presume we need to go find other plants and scan everything over there so we can find those keys that uh, they've been asking us to... Uh... Oh... There was a spot that was uh, highlighted in green. I think he's looking for us to scan specific things, yeah. So this is like quasi-tutorial here. Sort of. Guess this can help us fill up the codex or something. Rogue furnishing. Looks like I may have only one more thing to get for what I missed. Do have a quest here? There's a test drive of a mech you can hear. Yeah, I'm not sure that's what that's we should be fun. doing. Bar is stuff. Okay, so there's one more thing that I have to do. Definitely want to test drive a mech. It's a diamond. Uh, could be anything. I mean, pretty much everything can be scanned. Yeah, but it's supposed to be the shops. It's the thing that are in green. So, oh, here it is. The store is open for business. Be able to create custom signs here. Cool. That's it. Mm hmm. All right back to Esther. No, I'm gonna test drive a Mac. All right, then we're gonna test drive a Mac. <laughs> We might get one. You're way too optimistic. This game has not given us anything so far. Ready. Not sure how that's supposed to work, but sure. So... What do we need to do? Uh, I'm guessing go through the test course. Here. This one. 
Uh, I'm not sure there was anything to miss. Oh, make sure just ground movement, configuration with environment, gravity. Um. Game's hitching for me quite a bit. You will deplete over time. Okay. This way. Get him? I think so. Just a little bit of a tutorial. Yeah, I guess we'll be end up, end, end up building mechs like that ourselves. All right, so I'm guessing All we right. have to go talk to him to come. Yeah. I think that's the most fun part about this game is, is trying to go down a ladder and, and just taking a bunch of damage. <laughs> Back. Yeah, we just got enough parts to build our own mech. We've got a body, booster, a left arm, which has a flak cannon, legs, a right arm, which has a drill, and basic boosters. What do I do? Ready to deploy? Sure, I understand. This is telling me what. Um. No clue. Not sure. Not important right now. I think. Not important, it's a mech. All right, it's fine. We can play with your mech a bit more. I just don't understand. Uh, did we are is this done then? I guess that's what we have. I'm not really sure. I guess we'll just look at it another. I guess we need to put a horn on it or something. That's the only slot in the mech that isn't filled, but it seems so unimportant. Okay. So it's so unimportant. Right? Mechs are awesome. <laughs> not not the mechs, the parts that we miss on the mechs. Oh yeah. It sounded like we had a full mech though. Yeah. I mean, you wouldn't just say that an atlas is unready because it doesn't have a car horn. Or a white load sign. Okay. We need you to start finding these artifacts. Okay. Hmm. We have to find a forest planet. Yeah, essentially. Okay. I think it's about time we start opening. Later module. Tech card. And an upgrade module. What is this? What is what? <laughs> 
That's a very interesting looking weapon. All right, that, um, we'll see how good this thing is. All right, so I guess the main quest has pretty much gotten started. In which case we can just beam back to the ship. Unless you want to buy something in the shops. Um, I just want to try and figure stuff out. I'm somewhat confused. I don't know. I'm not sure I understand the whole thing with the mech. How it works. Not worry about it right now. Yeah, the mech is not going to help us at the moment anyway. So we have a functional ship now, I'm guessing. Thrusters are yeah, on I think online. So. FPL drive is online. Ship teleportation system function correctly. Fair universe is accessible. Um, oh, FTL convenient. drive can be mined from. Unpleasant something or other. So I'm guessing I have no fuel. Zero fuel. Have fuel? So we have no fuel. Right? Uh, yeah, that's pretty much what it comes down to. Okay, so we're stuck on this plan until we figure that out then, right? Well, uh, sort of. Okay. Let's see. Probably shouldn't have just randomly beamed down to the surface. And back into the uh, area we originally... Oh, how long ago we've been here? Probably not too properly. Oh, we can deploy the mech to the current orbited world. How do you do that? Uh, when you're in your ship and you choose the teleporter. Hmm. Why? I'm assuming it's just going to go where we start, though. Die, bird. <laughs> the mech gun does 100 damage. Yeah, that, that sounds a little bit overkill. Problem is you can't control where it beams in, right? I'm not sure. Maybe we need a different kind of uh, beacon for that. I know you can you can build your own teleporters. Yeah, maybe that's the key. Oh, the it mining still doesn't mining thing is quite nice. But I'm a little bit confused as to what to do next. Because I'm not seeing any uh, any particular means of getting fuel. Yeah, I mean, it, we need the same resource we had on that, that one base. From what I was reading. Poor thing. Mm. Yeah, mech is a little too overpowered for this planet at the moment. Is 
Still a lot of fun, though. But I think we've had enough of that. It was worth uh, figuring out. I would like. I'm not sure where you are at the moment, but... This I'm is good. aboard my own ship. Ah. Which is weird, because you were able to get there. Can you teleport to me directly? I can. Because I'm on board my ship right now, so... Um, I have to beam up to my ship first, though, to be able to... Yeah. That is, unfortunately, one of the things you do have to do. My kitty is always... On the teleporter pad, preventing me from being able to use it. Oh, there. You. Snake. It's not a snake. It looks it's like a, a snake. Uh, I think it's more like a snail, but. Well, it's not in, moving. In any right case. Now. Yeah, I think uh, this is a good point to go ahead and put a cut in things. Uh, was it yours? Or mine? I don't remember. <laughs> I don't remember at all. <laughs> we'll say it's yours. All right, well then, thank you all for watching from me and Mouse Gunner. See you all next time. Totally a snake.